What's going on, everybody? Thanks for tuning in to another episode. I'm your host, Janelle Wenguillo. <clears throat> Excuse me for the latest review. Uh, we won't be doing a jewelry review today. We're going to do something else special because my philosophy is don't just look clean, but be clean. OK, subscribe to this YouTube channel. Um, subscribe to my other YouTube channel where you can check out some of my music, old and new and some other things as well. Some of my old videos. And that's how you support me, because if you put some of my music on your uh, playlist and you play it in your car, in your house or whatever, you support this channel. Um, find something you like, put it on your playlist. My music is available on all digital outlets. Let's get straight into it. Don't just look fresh, be fresh. There's a lot of people, especially brothers, they be walking around and they got their jewelry on, but they got dirt in between their nails. You know, their clothes is dingy, they look dingy and they stink. I've actually like ran across people who they look fresh, they got drip on and all that and they stink. So today we're gonna, you know, do a, a review on some things concerning your hygiene. I don't believe in just getting on here and doing reviews and not helping nobody, right? I like to help people. If you're gonna spend your energy on anything, spend your energy on helping people. I'm a firm believer in that. So if you follow me and the people who follow me, they know I always like to give good tips and talk about, you know, random things. Um, and not just jury because I'm an older gentleman. I like to help people. You know what I mean? Especially the youth coming up. I'm not about to sit here and die and they say, oh, all he did was jury reviews. No, I want to help somebody. And this might be minute to somebody else, but this is not, this is major to, to, to someone else. Number one, what I like about this company is they're a black owned company. Number two, what I like about this company is um, they got bought out by Procter & Gamble, which is a, a huge non-cyclical company. Um, you know, Procter & Gamble, for those who are not familiar with Procter & Gamble, Procter & Gamble is, uh, own, you know, they own companies, uh, they're the parent company, I should say, and they own companies like Crest, Toothpaste, yeah, you know, stuff like that. I believe they own, uh, like, uh, I want to say Tide, and, and just, I would say almost 40 to 50% of the stuff that you see at Costco or Walmart as far as uh, products that we use on an everyday basis, Procter & Gamble is the parent company of those companies. So for a black owned business to be bought out, um, that's that's a big deal to me. Not to mention the fact that Nas, the rapper Nas, not not not, not Nas X, the real Nas, okay? Now, we don't want to get that twisted at all. The real legendary hip hop GOAT Nas backed up this company. And without further ado, I'm gonna open up this box. I have not opened up anything. You know, I, you know, sometimes I don't unbox stuff. So you see it's still here. I mean, I opened the box up, but I haven't opened up anything else. And this is going to be a different type of review for me. So y'all want y'all to be patient. So let's start with the uh, deodorant. OK, so there this is deodorant. They claim it's aluminum free, uh, penetrates coarse hair, etc., etc. It gives you protection. They say in 48 hours. So, you know, uh, they even got the directions on how to, you know, use the deodorant. You know what I mean? So uh, they say it's good for the skin and they claim that these products are especially good for African-American people. But I'm pretty sure anybody can use their brand. And we're going to go ahead and smell this real quick. OK, it's got like a light smell to it, almost like a soapy smell to it. OK, so that's that's OK. So, so far, so good. Let me rub that. You know, it's not too greasy. All right. All right. I'm feeling that. It's not it's not too it's not too greasy. All right. Put that on my arm there. You know what I'm saying? Smell it against my skin. It's got like a soapy smell to it. And I mean, almost like, I don't know, like like a, like a, a soapy smell, but it's real, real light. So it's not heavy. Like I put on certain deodorant, that's a real heavy smell. As soon as you open it up, you can smell it. So that's, that's, that's so far so good. Now let's open up. So I like the design that they got on the soap. You know, when you wash your hands or you wash your body, you know, uh, that's usually goes away. Now I'm gonna tell you this, I'm gonna tell y'all something personal about me. I don't really use bar soap. I have a certain, I, I use a loofah for my body and we're gonna get to that in a minute. But for soap, what I do is I have a towel that I use and I wash my ass, that's right. Soap usually is good for me washing my ass, okay? And getting up in that ass and make sure you smell good. You put the, you don't use the same towel on your body as you do for your ass. That's a whole separate towel, ladies and gentlemen. A whole separate bar of soap for my ass, and that's it. And I put this in a soap case, 
and I wash my hands after I wash my ass and then I fucking wash myself. OK, I hope I make myself clear and I hope you all understand what I'm saying, because there's some dirty motherfuckers out there. So, yeah, I don't use bar soap. So let me smell this real quick, unless it's to clean literally my fucking ass. This fucking smells great. OK, so just want to. Yeah, this is awesome. It, it, it smells great. That smells great. Um they saying it's a, a exfoliating bar soap. I'm probably not going to put this on my face, to be honest with you. I, I just, you know, I don't, you know, I, I can't say that. I might, I might, I might put a little on my, on my, on my face. I don't know. But like I said, I used to use the bar soap to wash my ass and, and, and that's it. You know, um, it's got the ingredients on the back and, uh, you know, they got big words on here. I get scared when I see big words on here. Um, you know, uh, but, uh, you know, it, it looks better than the normal uh, bars of soap because I see a lot of words with palm and oil and cocoa and butter and, you know, leaf. And, you know, that's a pretty good, you know, um, that's a plus because it, it doesn't have a, a lot of harsh chemicals. And the chemicals that they probably do use is just to actually make it into the bar of soap. So, so far, we're doing pretty good. Okay. And it smells good. Um, this doesn't smell like the, 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 um, deodorant to me. It has a, a clean smell. I can't even describe it. it it's, it's a clean smell, though. Um, I wish they had a, you know, uh, uh, uh some type of, uh, how can I say? Um, this description, but but they don't. It says, or oh, it says, it says, uh, you deserve better bar soap. Our body soap deeply cleans, exfoliate, and leaves skin feeling moisturized after each shower infused with shea butter and cocoa butter. Okay, so, like I said, I'm not putting this on my face. Um, I, I don't put a lot of stuff on my face. Um, I put some maybe body wash sometime on my face, but I'm not about to use. It's gonna be the ass of face for that soap. You know, that's what I'm saying. Watch, I'm probably gonna end up washing my ass with it. Cause I got a whole separate towel. And I'm reiterating re 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 that on purpose. Cause man, some people be stanking. And y'all just need to learn how to wash y'all ass. I used to work at a gym. So I was shocked at the people who got money and who look a certain type of way, who like had bad habits. Cause I was the janitor and I had to clean the shower. And it was fucking disgusting. Okay, so let's go to the lotion. Um, so this is the body lotion. They claim they got argon and, and shea butter in there and it deeply moisturized. We about to find out in a minute. I'm an ashy brother, so we gonna find out in a minute what's going on with the, okay. It's pretty smooth, it's not too oily. It gives me a St. Ives, I-V-E-S, St. Ives vibe. You know, um, you know, I'm not feeling nothing magical happening right now. Let me smell it. Mm, it's got a nice little soft smell to it. Uh, it. Once again, it gives me like a St. Ives vibe. You know what I mean? I don't know if y'all are familiar with that. It almost gives me a St. Ives vibe, you know, lotion, if you ever used that lotion before. Um, and this is the body wash. Of course, I can't um, <laughs> tell y'all how this works or whatever, how it is. And maybe I'll do a review, but what we're going to do is we're going to smell it and we're going to look at it at least. Let me open this up. Let me see what's going on here. Okay. Oh, shit. I see little seeds and all type of stuff going on in that body wash. Okay. So it's it's, it's, it's pretty thick. I like my body wash to be pretty thick because when it's not thick, then it's like it don't work. That That's, that's, I'm, I'm feeling that. Let me, let me smell this. Man, I like this right here, y'all. This, now this smell like a rich, luxurious, clean body wash right here i ain't even gonna hold y'all up i think this together is gonna be the bomb i do i'm i'm feeling that now they got the seeds in there they're claiming this uh, exfoliating body wash i'm using this today you know what i mean when i get off work and i take my shower i'm definitely using this today so ladies and gentlemen i hope i didn't bore y'all with this but bevel is the bomb I, i'm feeling this it's black owned um, I'm definitely, you know, Nas backed it up. He invested in this company and I'm definitely about to uh, take part in this and see what's going on. But, you know, don't just look fresh, be fresh. Don't just wear your drip and you stink and you ain't took a shower in two days. 
that's disgusting so i teach y'all how to wash your jewelry now i'm gonna teach you how to wash your ass okay start off with this bevel right here this bevel is tight i'm feeling that hope y'all enjoyed this review come back at me check out some of my other videos don't forget to subscribe peace